Welcome, welcome, welcome to Season 3, Episode 3 of Office Hours with yours truly in partnership with The Loft. Today, we're going to talk about the generative AI. Everyone is talking about this for the past six months. Everyone has been talking about it, even people that know nothing about generative AI, which is why I'm going to talk about generative AI right now. Um, I believe, a lot of people believe, that this is a foundational technology, transversal, that will be applied to all parts of our economies, to all verticals, and to uh, all industries, and that will change the way we do business, right? Uh, either for text, for audio, for video, um, the changes are going to be absolutely uh, uh, amazing. None more so than in financial services, and I believe that uh, some fintech startups are starting to apply generative AI within their processes, right? When you think that there are large chunks of the financial services industry, uh, processes and value adds that are being performed by medium skill to highly skilled people, but in repetitive ways, right? Think about AML, KYC, uh, think about like all kinds of operational uh, uh, processes that are, be that are being done either manually or semi-manually in a rote way without 100% creativity, right? These high paying jobs are at risk. They're at risk because now we are going to have, or soon we will have, models that are being trained on subject matter expertise, right, uh, that are applied to financial services, and that will completely disrupt uh, how we do business. So yesterday, no generative AI. Let's say you have 100 people within a group that, do, that perform one particular task. Tomorrow, with generative AI, you'll have 20 people that uh, uh, do this job with the help of a couple of uh, agents that are trained on that particular job. Make that at scale for uh, a lot of financial service products, a lot of financial services. Ser uh, services. Make, that, make that at scale for certain ecosystems, capital markets, asset management, for example, the fund services industry in Luxembourg, and gener generative AI will have an amazing uh, impact, a very material impact uh, over the next uh, five to 10 years. That was my lesson for today. Goodbye for now, and I hope to see you with the next episode.